seniors. Our first senior is number 10, Clay Lawson. Clay is the first of and Shelby Lawson. Clay has been playing basketball for 13 years. His fondest memory is grinding with the boys every summer. Future plans are to go to OTC, then transfer to Evander. Parents stops to play. We've had so much fun watching you play the sports you love over the years. Game days are our favorite days. Thank you for being a good son and making our job as parents easy. Go make the world a better place. Ladies and gentlemen, number 10, Clay Lawson. Our next high school senior, number one, Nick Losh. Nick's parents are Joe and Nicole Losh. Nick has been playing basketball here at Stratford High School for four years. Fondest memory, throwing water on Coach Ryerson and everyone in the fourth time tournament. Future plans for Nick are to go to college. Parents stops for Nick. Nicholas, someone once said, the best versions of ourselves don't come out when everything is amazing. The best versions of ourselves come out in the midst of trial. Embrace uncertainty. Some of the most beautiful chapters in our lives won't have a title until much later. We love you and couldn't be more proud of the man that God planned you to be. Love, Mom and Dad. Ladies and gentlemen, Our next senior, number 12, Sawyer Lonely. Sawyer's parents are Rusty and Cinnamon Lonely. Sawyer has been playing basketball since the age of three. His fondest memory, when Mason Foley had a stomach issues during warm-ups freshman year. Future plan for to continue his academic and basketball career at OTC University using his A-plus scholarship for two years. Parents thoughts for Sawyer? Sawyer, Saw, and yes, Saw. We have watched you play basketball and love the game since you could walk and say ball. More important than the game, basketball over the last two years with your knee injury has taught you about the game of life. We have watched you overcome it. Walk through fear and pain and come through it only stronger. Basketball has taught you patience, adversity, confidence, and has made you stronger in your faith. We could not be any prouder of the prouder of you as a player, but more importantly as a son of God. We are so thankful he shared you with us these years as a parent. This life is yours to go play, have fun, love mom, dad, G, and B. Ladies and gentlemen, number 12, Sawyer, mom dad. Our next senior, number two, Zach Lucian. Zach's parents are Robert and Christy Lucian. Zach has been playing basketball since he could walk. Fondest memory, playing every game with my best friends and playing in front of the best fan base around. Future plans, go to college and study criminology. Parents thoughts for Zach. You have outgrown our lives, and we will never outgrow our hearts. You are our blessing from God, and our hearts have over, overflowed with the joy as we have watched you grow into the wonderful young man that stands by, beside us today. God holds you securely in his hands, and we cannot wait to watch you succeed in all the plans God has for your life. Commit to the Lord whatever you do, and you will succeed. Proverbs 16, 13. We are so proud of you, and we love you so much, Mom, Dad, and Blake. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Our next high school senior, number 34, Gabe Mahan. Gabe's parents are John and Teresa Mahan. Gabe has been playing basketball for 12 years. His fondest memory, finding the energy before every game. His future plans are to go to Harding University and decide what I'm going to major. Parents' thoughts for Gabe. Gabe had come into our family the natural way he first came into our lives in 2002. We were foster parents and greeted him with open arms and hearts. We were blessed 
that in November 2006, he officially became our son. He is faithful and active Christian who believes, whose beliefs have served him well in his relationship with others. Over the years, he has grown in knowledge, st stature, wisdom, and in making decisions that have guided his plans and actions. We look forward to his future accomplishments with assurance that he will find success in whatever path he chooses. Ladies and gentlemen, Gabe Mahan. Our next senior, number 22, Gabe Rear. Gabe's parents are Matthew and Cindy Rear. Gabe has been playing basketball for 11 years. His fondest memory is celebrating with the guys after last year's district win over Fair Grove. Future plans to attend college at OTC and MSU and pursue a rewarding career and be the GOAT of intramural sports. Parents' thoughts for Kay. They say the game of basketball is a game of numbers. This game is giving you so much happiness 95% of the time. You have had 10 amazing coaches that have taught you so much about this wonderful game, teamwork, determination, and perseverance. The countless great players you have played with and against, but most of all, remember the great times with the six guys that are standing next to you now. You have spent hours developing into the player you are now, and we couldn't possibly be prouder of you. When the last horn sounds, know that you have put 100% effort in to come out with zero regrets. We will always and forever love watching you play. Mom, Dad, and Chloe. Ladies and gentlemen, Kate Greer. Our last senior, number 20, Jacob Stowe. Jacob's parents are Dwayne and Bridget Stowe. Jacob has been playing basketball here at Stratford for six years. His fondest memory, playing with my brothers all these years. Future plans are to complete that ASC certification for auto mechanics at OTC and find a job. Plans are thoughts for Jacob, parents' thoughts for Jacob. We are so proud of the young man you've become. We cannot believe you are a senior, but cannot wait to see what the next chapter of your life holds. Always stay strong in your faith. We know God has big plans for you. We have loved watching you play basketball since you were little. We will miss watching the seniors play together. We will always be your biggest fans. Love, Dad, and Mom. Ladies and gentlemen, David